Hello, and welcome back to Minecraft Direwolf 20 Pack. So, uh, the power cube here, or energy cube, has been perpetually low. And the reason for that, that I didn't realize at first, is because the quantum entangleloper, entangle, entangle porter here, uh, has not come finished filling up with energy yet. This is the one that goes and, uh, does our lava for us. So all the excess energy, instead of being stored in the cube, has been going into that. We're almost there on it, though, so I figured it was probably about time to go ahead and get started. So, we're going to be doing some stuff today. We have lava coming in. We can easily get water. That should allow us to make obsidian. The question is, how are we going to go about that? Because doing it manually like that was a big pain. So, I have got stuff set up in here to make the advanced machine frames, but we still need some pink slime. So let's go grab one bucket of pink slime. Do, do, do. There we go, one bucket of pink slime. And let us put it right there. And there we go. We have this getting processed. I've got enough stuff to do a second one because, uh, you know, this only takes half a bucket. So I kind of want to keep this thing cleared out. So I kind of got to do it in those proportions. So there's that. We still have half a bucket worth of pink slime in there. So in the rest of those guys go. And here we go getting another one made. And we'll come back to that in a moment. We don't need it this exact second. But what can we do with this advanced machine frame? Well, we were looking at this stuff earlier, weren't we? And what we need is... Now, this is what we ended up using it for before, was the mob crusher. What we need, however... Ooh, the ore laser might be nice. Not what I'm after, though. I am after this guy right here, the material stonework factory. Now, we're also going to need a pink slime for this. A couple of plastic, which I have, some gold gears, crafting table, diamond pickaxe. That's all easy enough for us. So we needed the pink slime. So it's just going to be some pink slime and glass pane. Ooh, that's going to be interesting. I should probably... Yeah, I'm going to need some water, too. This will prove interesting. This will prove interesting. All right. Let's get some glass panes. We'll start... Well... Let's do this. And we should be able to do that. All right. This guy's ready here. Let's go ahead and put the glass... Oh. Right, you have to do it one at a time. So annoying. All right, let's go ahead and grab a couple buckets worth of this stuff. Do, do, do. I do wonder... You know what? Let's... uh. Can I just do this like you used to be able to? We're going to let that sit there for a minute. Let's go ahead and grab another bucket. We'll come back to that in a minute. Let's not have that in my hand. There we go. All right. You. Go in there. Go in there. Oh. You, uh don't seem to mind the fact that you don't have the water. Oh, you produce water doing that. Okay, I didn't realize that's what that meant. All right. How are we doing over here? You're just still sitting there as pink slime. All right, I guess it's not going to do it. it. used to be that there were mobs that were pink slimes that would spawn if you left the pink slime sitting out. And it usually didn't take very long. So that should be three buckets worth in there. It should. Allow me to do this, but I don't... I think it's... I don't think I can do the shift-click thing here. Let me, let me try it real quick. Oh, okay, I can shift-click, but it only keeps one. All right, good good to know, good to know. All right, so what we want is the material... There we go, the material stonework factory. 
So we still need a couple of parts. Let's get ourselves a furnace. Easy enough. Let's get ourselves a diamond pick. Easy enough. Let's get ourselves some gold gears. Also easy enough. And we still need a crafting table. Crafting table. Easy enough. All right. Bam. We have material stonework factor. Uh, just kind of keep sticking glass in there as we go. All right, now, material stonework factory. Where do I want to set this? I kind of want to set this about here. Let's just kind of put you right there. That's probably a terrible spot, but that's where it is. Okay, so we can set this to generate a bunch of different things. Now, the cobblestone, where's the cobblestone? It needs a bucket of water and a bucket of lava, and it doesn't consume anything. Another wreck, it needs odd amounts and consumes also odd amounts. Interesting. Obsidian use, needs a bucket of lava and a bucket of water and consumes the water. No, it consumes the lava. That actually works out pretty well. Let's go ahead and pick this guy back up. And let's see where we can stick this. I should be able to just put this right on, well, right next to this guy, right? Oh, right on top. I should be able to put you, like, right on top of you. Right like that. And if I come over here, I should be able to say... Uh, power can get ejected out the top. Auto eject, please. You have power. Nice. And what we're going to do is we're going to set you to obsidian. And we're also going to say fluid output the top. You already are ejecting, so there we go. Now this is going to give us a constant stream of power and lava. Now all we need is a single bucket of water. Hey look, there's this flowing water over here that I had for making the obsidian before. Boop, there we go. And now you are generating lava. Look at that. It's gener er, generating lava. Generating obsidian. Awesome. Now we have a constant source of obsidian. I also have some lava here that I set up uh, just in case. I've got, you know, a magmatic dynamo running with two. I think I did that last episode before the end. I don't necessarily think I uh, set up that tank there, though. I think I did that between. It's been a quite a bit of time. I was waiting for the power and I was waiting for the plastic and all that fun stuff. Did I have plastic in here that it used? Because, huh. All right. Anyway, we need to... Not that. Thank you. Wait. Why do I have two advanced machine frames here? Did I have an advanced machine frame left in here? I guess maybe I did. Weird. But we'll be able to make more material stonework factories. We could get it set up so that it outputs pretty much everything you can get from cobblestone. And those guys are useful. Anyway, now that we have the obsidian, we were getting this for Woot. We're trying to stay focused. All right. So, what did we need? It was some sort of anvil thing, right? Yeah, the Stygian anvil. Bam. There we go. We have our Stygian anvil. Now, what did we need this for? We needed this for the mob shard, which needs a shard die. All right, so we need obsidian, nether quartz. And we get the shard die. I think that's what it's saying. Is it night again already? I just slept just before I started the episode, and it's night again already. I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. Such a problem. <sighs> Always night, I swear. All right. So we need to find a nice little spot for this Stygian anvil to sit. We're not going to need it much, so maybe we'll just stick it in the corner down here. Do you need power? Place valid base item first. Okay, I think... So is that this? 
No. It would be the quartz, right? Let's grab a piece of another quartz. Maybe. Alright. Now one of you? Okay. And now I hit you with the hammer? Anvil must be sitting on a magma block. Oh, well, that's a thing. I guess we're heading back to the nether. Because I certainly can't think of any place else I'm going to get a magma. Well, I can think of maybe a couple of places. But let's go to the nether. Oof. Pigman, go away. Nobody likes you. Is that all of you? You done? I sure hope so. Alright. Let's find ourselves a magma block. Now, where are we going to find one of them? Shroom light. Yeah, see, this is not the best biome for this start. Alright. Hmm. Really? Go away, stupid animals. Alright. Magma block. Where am I gonna find magma block? Let's see. Maybe down? Down probably sounds good, right? Down closer to the lava? Maybe outside the biome. Well, that's a big old lava lake, ain't it? Ow. Came in a little hard. Alright, let's turn that off for the moment. Hmm. Not seeing much of anything around here. A little bit of gold. Alright. Let's look around, shall we? Hmm. You know what? Let's quickly... purple beacon. I should have a purple beacon around here. Is it up or down? I somehow don't think it's down. Unless it is. I don't know. I don't know. around. Alright, I got a little bit of a purple beacon. I just, just aha, it's gotta be down, right? Yeah, it's gotta be down. Yeah, there you are. Do, do, do. Alright, we're gonna try something else. We're gonna try something else. was the last of the bread. Good thing I made some baked potatoes. Alright. 
now the first question is is did I pick up any magma blocks anywhere else at any point in time no okay I did not is there any way to craft magma blocks from magma cream which I do not currently have access to injection press I don't know what this one is that's from woot oh interesting and it gets me lava back out of it plus magma block okay huh interesting interesting okay however none of that is really what i was thinking so i'm thinking there is this spot right there and since I now have this handy dandy jetpack, not that. What am I? What, 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 what am I doing? All right, oh, that. Okay, let's go ahead and see if we can get over there. Look at how fast I go. Look at this. I, this is why I built this. This is for the bloody speed. Yeah. Look at how quick I am. Here's a village. Goodbye, village. Meow. Whoop, there we are. Ha ha. All right. So you are a magma block. Look at that. Uh, let's go ahead and just grab those as well. We'll leave the rest of that for the moment. We don't necessarily need a whole lot of it. Let's go back home. Look at me flying. And this will make exploring the nether a whole lot easier, too, when we eventually have to. Oh, yeah, I can just do that. I didn't realize I actually had the option to just hold shift to go down. Makes sense. Just for whatever reason, I didn't think of it. All right, so down we go. We grab that one block right there and we put this block in its place oh hey i got a crossbow neat excellent all right now where did the oh okay cool i got the shard die somehow I'm not entirely certain exactly how that happened, but it could we? All right, so how do I use you? Oh, I just put you in a crafting window with a ender pearl. Easy enough. All right, we'll put you guys away. I don't need any of you. Let's put the obsidian away. You and you go in with a single ender pearl. Bam! All right. Attack mob with this shard to capture. Kill mobs to fill the shard. Shard must be in your hot bar to fill. Can be cleared in the crafting table. So, so we'll put that guy in the hot bar. We're gonna clear that. Out. We are one step closer to having what we need. So we should probably clear this out before we go looking. I am mildly annoyed that I'm getting water out of this, though. <clears throat> doop, doop, doop. And of course, the one major problem with this thing is that the uh, uh, the the pink slime balls count as regular slime. Yeah, I, did, I thought that that was a, a desync bug. That nah, was desync. Um, we're gonna need to fill the flux capacitor up again. That's fine. We'll just shove you in there for the moment. Pink slime in there. We will be using that later. We want you in our hot bar. You don't necessarily need to be in the hot bar. All right. So we are now going to go need to f go need to find another fortress. But before we do that, I want waystones. I would like waystones. All right. So we need these warp stones. Oh, is that what I was doing the purple for? That's what I was doing the purple for. I need the purple dye plate. Pure dye fluid. What is all this? 
All right, waystone from waystones. What in the world? Okay. Oh, no, I can just do it with purple dye. Okay. Okay. So purple dye. Do I have the stuff for purple dye? I do not because I don't have any red. All right. Okay. We're going to go to bed because it's always night. It was the waystones. Yes, that was two episodes ago where I was like, what was I getting this for? I don't remember. Dur, 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 dur. I don't necessarily need an infinite source like I was to think I was originally planning. Just a few will do. Let's see. Uh, let's not be near wherever, whatever that is. Now, what can I do with you? Not, how do I make you? Actually, how do I make you? Oh, I can just put you in a... It's way easier than the beetroot thing. Let's make a botany pot, a hopping botany pot. Actually, let's also make a different type of chest, like, say, an iron chest. There we go. And then we need a... Bot and meat. Pot. We need one of you. One of you. And one of you. I don't have the terracotta. I need clay. All right. We need five. One, two, three, four, five. Boop. Wait. No. Bam. I was cooking up some silver because I didn't have any. Right. Do, 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 do. I did not realize that I could just grow the stupid flowers. Ah, oh, so annoying. So annoying. I am annoyed. Can you tell I am annoyed? All right. Uh, botany. Hopping botany pot. Go. All right. Uh, I am going to need some doit. Good. Good. All right. So we're going to put this in between. This is why I made it in an iron chest instead of the regular one, because I wouldn't have been able to put it there. I'm going to put you just like that. I'm going to put a piece of dirt in you. And then we're going to take one of these, put it in there. All right, you take a minute to grow, whatever. All right, now, how? All right, so I can obviously just craft it. Uh, crushing it would not get me red dye. Enrichment chamber would get me two. Um... What else could I do to get more dye? Centrifugal separator. I don't have one of those. Squeezer would be... How much... What do I... That mm, takes a bit of iron, but... Mm, you know what? I'll just enrichment chamber it. I don't need too much. Oh, right. I was still enrichment chambering that. There we go. Go back in there. We might need you. All right, what was I doing? Waystones. 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 Purple dye. Give me purple dye. Thank you. All right, waystone. Way, waystones. Warp stone. Warp stone. Good. I don't have stone blocks because I don't have stone. I don't think we did that either. All right, let's just make some stone. Uh, do, 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 do. Grab a stack of cobble. Turn it into a stack of stone. All right. Waiting on that. And look at that. Now I'm just making poppies to make red dye. Instead of the giant pain process that me trying to find beetroot. Imagine if I hadn't bothered trying to get beetroot. And then forgot what I was getting it for. I remembered it was for purple dye. <laughs> oh, this is so bad. What is going on? Oh, why is why is, why am I like this? Why am I like this? All right. Let's just grab a few of them. Call that good. We want waystone. Way 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 stone. Oh, oh. waystone. All right. Bam. We need two of you. Excellent. All right. Now. 
very importantly. We're going to head back into the nether. All right. Right there. You are going to be... Nether portal. You are another portal. And you are active. Now, I'm going to go out and try to find a fortress. I will be right back when I have found one, hopefully. Alright, I am back. As you can see, I've burned through, like, 7% of my battery on the uh, jetpack. And we have found ourselves another fortress. I am, uh, quite a ways away. Oh, hey, looks like there was another one over there that I missed somehow. That's okay. That's okay. What we're going to do is we're going to go ahead... Oop. There we go. All right. Let us quickly boop around to see if we can find an actual spawner. Meow. Nope. Nope. Oh, that's a lot of dudes. Hello, dudes. Uh, let's actually go ahead and, I guess, hit them with the thing. Can I hit you? Ow. Yes, that's... Yes, that's fire. Can I hit you? Can I hit you? I don't know that I want to... Alright, hang on. Potato. Are you, uh... You are not bound yet. I hear... Hello. Alright. Hang on. Or potato. Alright, let's get... Hey, look at me. I'm here. Shoot at me. Thank you. Alright, now... I think that's probably going to have done it. I will assume for the moment. Five. I need five. Okay. Tell you what, how about... Alright, you... Stop it. Stop it. Go away. Eat. Come here. Alright, I got a blaze rod. That's good. a little bit quick to be doing aerial maneuvers here. Fortunately, the battery on this thing is pretty darn big. Alright, let's uh, settle down here a second. Okay. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. Let's, like, right here. Right here looks like a good spot. Let's, uh... Let us kind of do a little thing. So what we're going to do is we're going to take, I guess, some lava stone. How about lava stone? And what I'm going to do... me. Just gonna kind of do that. You're looking pretty good. Look 
looks kind of okay. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to block this off a little bit. Just a little. And we're going to put down our waist down. Like right there. And you are going to be another fortress. Yes. Another fortress. Done. You are also activated. Also. Can we waypoint? Add waypoint. Wave stone. Done. All right. Now, let's see if we can't get a couple more of these blazes. Now. Do -do 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 -do. Don't mind me. Now, I know I've gone past the wrapping up point once again. So tell you what, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to finish filling this shard, and we will come back next episode and hopefully start building what we need for the actual spawner. But that is going to do it for this episode. So, until next time, have a good one.